So now I'm going to explain to you how to program quicksort in Java. I'm going to do it functionally. That means we don't destroy any of the parameters of our functions. We just return new values, which are the result of applying the functions. So let's explain quicksort. Quicksort takes an array list of integers called A, and it returns a new array list, which is the result of sorting A. So here we go. If A has got either one or zero elements in it, then there's nothing to do. Our A is already sorted, so we simply return A. If, if it's got more than one element, we divide A in a way which we, I'll explain later. So that'll give us two arrays, two, two array lists. We sort the first half and store that in B. Um, we then add the first element of A to the end of B. And then we sort the second half of, of A and we add that to the end of B again. So we've got the first half, then the first element, the first half sorted, then the first element, then the second half sorted, and we return B, having constructed it in that way. So the, the next question is, how do we, how do we uh, divide this array A in half? Well, as you can see, divide returns a pair. What is a pair? Well, let's have a look how we, how we've defined a pair. A pair is simply a pair of array lists. The first one we've called first and the second one called second. And here we've got the constructor for pairs where we simply assign the, um, the uh, instance variables to the parameters in the normal way. So a pair is simply a way of storing a pair of array lists. So having seen that, how do we then define our, um, our divide method? Well, what divide does, it takes an array, list A, and returns a pair. So we have this, uh, we, we have this thing called the pivot, which is the first element of, of A. So we get the first element of A and store this in, this in this variable called pivot. We then create two new array lists, B and C, and then we go through A, looking, looking at each element of A. If it's less than the pivot, we add it to B. Otherwise, we add it to C. So simply, uh, in our B will be all the things less than the pivot, and C will be all the things greater than the pivot. And we then simply return the pair consisting of B and C. And that's all there is to our um, to quick sort. So in, here's our here's our pro here's our main method for trying out quick sort. Uh, what we do is we have a um, I simply um, allow the user to enter as many values as command line arguments into the array list B, we uh, quick sort B, return the result as A, and we print out A. Simple as that. So that's how to do quick sort um, functionally in Java. Thanks very much for listening.